for thousands of years, we've had very superstitious thoughts about luck. In fact, the reality is that your thoughts create the luck in your life. If you think you're going to be a lucky person, the chances are you're going to experience lots of good fortune. If you think you're going to be an unlucky person, then you are going to experience ill fortune. So luck is not something that happens to you, it's something you create. I think luck as a concept is absolutely central to our lives. And in the Aim Higher survey, what we found was about 82% of lucky people are prepared to work hard to create their good luck. And that's consistent with our other research. On the flip side, about 80% of unlucky people are out there trusting destiny, trusting fate. They're not putting any effort into it. For them, luck is something that happens to them, not something they create. When it comes to creating your own luck, a big part of it is how you see yourself and see the world. So the lucky people are very positive, they attract people to them. When they see an opportunity, they make the most of it. When bad things happen, as they do to everyone, they're very resilient, so they'll bounce back. The unlucky people tend to be very fatalistic. They're convinced that they're going to experience bad luck. So they think, well, you know, I'm going to fail the exam or the job interview is not going to go well. So there's no point in preparing. And I guess that becomes a self-fulfilling prophecy. So you can see there's a psychology where people create their own good and bad luck. If you look at um, the people who win a major TV talent show, and you think, my goodness, that, that could be me. That's the only pathway to fame and fortune. Well, you're just being silly about it. That's just unrealistic. In fact, there are other pathways through, you know, getting into higher education, getting to university, colleges, uh, getting a, a good degree and so on. It's far more likely to lead to a lucky life. Obviously, you have to push for things. You can't just rely on luck. You have to further your ambitions by being proactive, I think, not just rely on good fortune. I think it all comes down to hard work. I don't think it has anything to do with the alignment in the stars or anything. I just think if you work, then you'll get what you want. If I want something, then I go for it. I have to do something to, to get that luck. You know, when it comes to education, it's very easy to uh, adopt a fatalistic mindset, to say, you know, it's, it's for others, it's not for me, it's not something that I do. And I think Aim Higher breaks down that barrier. It says, look, it is there for you, and you should make the most of that opportunity. That, that's the way lucky people would see it. They go, well, well what's here, and how can it help me? And I, I think the Aim Higher campaign really breaks those, down those barriers, and it allows people access to these opportunities.